What's up, people? Welcome back. Well, this morning, not a good morning, because I picked up some rather discouraging news, at least when it comes to the latest upcoming Ubuntu 16.04 and AMD users. All right, here we go. According to this article and some other articles, I have verified why AMD users may want to avoid Ubuntu 16.04 LTS. If you use the AMD Catalyst, the FGL, FGL RX, sounds like a prescription. Anyway, if you use the FGL RX driver on Ubuntu, you may wish to avoid upgrading to Ubuntu 16.04. The Xenial Xerus will not support the widely used and widely hated, well, I don't hate it, come on, uh, proprietary graphics driver for AMD ATI. Instead, Ubuntu recommends using open source alternatives, Radeon and AMD GPU, and say AMD put a lot of work into these drivers and we backported kernel code from Linux 4.5. Okay, I will not read all of this here, but from what I gather, gather if you are a casual computer user, you may not run into a problem. I stress the word may. If you are a heavy graphics user or a gamer, uh, you're gonna have to either wait a year or so until all this gets sorted out or don't upgrade to Ubuntu 16.04 or go out and buy a new computer. Oh joy. Uh, I think mine users uses that driver. Let me do a quick um, search here on my computer for additional drivers. Yeah, if you are a gamer, you may want to hold off upgrading at least for a while. Or I guess I guess you could always go out and uh, change your graphics card. I guess that may be a solution. It seems when it comes to Linux, it seems that for as long as I can remember. It seems that either uh, NVIDIA or Intel graphics seem to play nicer with Linux. Um, yeah, I'm using that FGLRX driver. So it's kind of discouraging because I was going to, once the Ubuntu Mate 16.04 came out, I was going to delete Ubuntu. 14.04, nothing wrong with Ubuntu 14.04. I was going to upgrade to the latest Ubuntu Mate. But if this is an issue, I don't know. I mean, I really don't feel like going out to buy a new computer. Anyway, let me know what you guys think. On a lighter note, if you haven't already, check out my interview, my exclusive conversation with Quids Up. Not Kids Up. <laughs> Quids Up from the UK. We finally got our schedules together and talked a little bit about Linux Mint, the Linux Mint breach, and PC security for both Linux and Windows users. I'll have all the links below in the show notes. Thank you for all of your positive and encouraging comments. Yes, I will be happy to do some more conversation with uh, Quids Up, a joy to talk to. And Quids, if you are watching this, hello, how are you? All right, well, that's all I have for this one. The sun is coming out, so I need to go out and catch some rays to hopefully make me feel better in spite of the discouraging news this morning. That's all I have for this one. If you haven't already, subscribe and support this Total OS Today technology channel. As always, enjoy your technology, and please don't text and drive. Ciao.